Twitter launched a paid service called Twitter Blue. Great, what's Twitter Blue? Twitter has a new paid subscription service called Twitter Blue. The first places it went live were Canada and Australia. The monthly costs are $3.49 Canadian or $4.49 Australian. The free version of Twitter is staying free. The company was clear in its blog post saying that the free Twitter will never go away. So what does paying Twitter get you? Do you finally get an edit tweet button? No, not really. However, if you pay for Twitter Blue, you'll get a new option called Undo Tweet. It's kind of like how Unsend works in Gmail and in Outlook. You can set a timer of up to 30 seconds. So when you hit tweet, you're not really tweeting. Instead, Twitter waits to publish that tweet until your timer is up. If you want to fix that tweet, you can hit Undo. Is this an amazing feature? I mean, maybe. How many times have you tweeted something and then realized you have a typo or forgot to tag someone? Then you have to go into Twitter, find your tweet, and delete it, and then you gotta start all over again. With undo tweet, that initial tweet is never seen by the world as long as you realize your mistake and act on it within 30 seconds. If you're very confident that you really wanna send that tweet now, you can use the send now button. Twitter Blue also features bookmark folders. I don't know how many of you bookmark tweets, but if you do, you might really like this. Right now, when you bookmark a tweet, it goes into this great big list of bookmarks. That's not super helpful. However, if you're willing to pay a little for blue, you can organize your bookmarked tweets with folders. This seems like a power user tool, and there's nothing wrong with that. Then there's the reader mode. This one's a bit odd. Twitter says that, quote, reader mode provides a more beautiful reading experience by getting rid of the noise. We are making it easier for you to keep up with long threads by turning them into easy to read text. This seems like a great idea for super long Twitter threads. However, this seems like something that should be built into regular free Twitter, right? Like if I want to read tweets, shouldn't it always be easy to read? I guess not. Is that all for Twitter Blue? Nope. There's a little bit more. Twitter says subscribers get access to perks like customizable app icons for their devices, home screens, and quote, fun color themes for their Twitter app, end quote. That's great. Who would want unfun color themes? And if you pay for Twitter Blue, you get access to dedicated subscription customer support. Now, how many times have you used Twitter and thought, hey, I want to talk to the company about this? This will likely be very useful for smaller businesses to get a line into Twitter. The company says that more features should roll out over time. When will Twitter Blue come to other places? Well, the company didn't mention that. I can see why Twitter is still hesitant in allowing an edit tweet button. Imagine this scenario. I write a tweet that says, who loves apple pie? And then there's lots of responses because apple pie is the best. But then I edit the tweet after the fact to say, who hates apple pie? and then all heck breaks loose. Twitter would have to have some way to lock the replies to tweets to the original one before editing. Just a thought. Are you excited about these features or is there something else you wanna see out of Twitter Blue? Let us know. I'm Ayaz Akhtar and I'll see you online.